Morning YouTube, yes it's me and I'm back again and as they used to say where I come from it's a large morning for a small place so any road in the unlikely event that you're actually checking out this video and Lord you must be hard up for entertainment if you are but if you are thanks for watching any road so as you can see I'm out in the Bundu doing my Daniel Boom bit again. Uh, it doesn't look too bad from where I am. Uh, from well, from this angle, does it? Uh, so as you can see, a slight change of equipment for me. I've been experimenting with Russian plash palatkas, two on them in fact. Uh, so now I'll grant you this setup does look a bit shaky. But I didn't set it up until 11 o'clock last night because it was a last minute decision to come out and it was pitch black when I was setting it up and I was using my head torch which is this little one here it's a night car um, and it's gotten a white LED, which is, and they all have that, don't they? But that one yonder is a red one. So it's very handy in spots where you're not meant to be because it's red and it doesn't show up like Withensee Lighthouse, which is the last thing you want when you're round here. Because there's a the main lot of nebby folk round here I can tell you anyway so that's the exterior of it it's propped up by my walking stroke hiking staff no hiking staff are not people that I employ to carry me gear Oh, chance would be a farm thing, eh? Any road. So, cooking wise, I was using my very, very homemade uh, stove. Which is uh, made from it's a barbecue fire starter it did originally have there a handle which was like a, a double like a beer mug handle uh, that you held it with and you hold it over the barbecue and it acts like a, a chimney and makes the charcoal start up a good main bit quicker you know but uh, I were in the shop and I seen it and I thought, bah, that'd make a grand stove if you take the handle off and cut the front out. So, as you can see, that's what I did. And there you have it. Now the, the stove top grill bit, for the laugh of me, I can't rightly remember where that come from, but it just fits on the, on the top of it like, grand you know so it's uh, it is what it is it does the job anyway so I'll show you the inside of me bivvy so there's a very thin but very lightweight ground sheet 
and then as a sort of a makeshift pillow there's my folded up combat jacket and then there is an actual pillow there now these only cost a pound at the pound shop and for the money <laughs> they work pretty damn good so if you see one it's worth risking a quid you know uh, sort of over there is uh, no, an old uh, Russian or Polish or East German or Czechoslovakian take your pick uh, aluminum water bottle uh, there's the my hat upside down um, and then that was the sleeping bag as I was using last night it's uh, a Nevado 300 well you can see that can't you um, it's rated down for comfort it's rated down to 45 degrees Fahrenheit and it got down to about 40 41 here last night but it worked fine I mean it was champion you know it done the job um, oh and there is a very thin uh, foam mat not right we certain of the mech to be honest but I mean that's how thin it is literally it's like I'd say three mil and I'm being generous at that but uh, you know if you're prepared to set the rough with the even rougher it's uh, it does the job it's not a bad little setup so sort of a, a 360 and by the edge of the air on colder navigation and as you can see I have a very enticing view of the back of some manky old industrial units that uh, and there's a duck so it's uh, it's not totally horrible out here um, this is a little little bit better See, there's a couple more ducks there so there's a bit of wildlife here although I'm just scaring them off now like but uh, there's worse places to spend your Saturday night and then back around um, just there that little grey strip as you can see that's the footpath well actually it's the it's the canal towpath I suppose you'd call it it's the uh, and during the day because uh, I say during the day it's now it's 4.54 Sunday morning uh, the 29th of the 5th well, for all you Americans the 5.29 2002 because you have that weird way of changing dates round for some reason but there you go so any road as I say that is the psychopath cycle path I nearly said psychopath then and to be an apt description for me I reckon so any road that's it basically So, I would have liked to show you some of the kit in action, but there was hardly any wood to be had round here at all. I mean, I mean, the one reason I actually came here was because the last time I was here, there was a rake of wood. You know, there were, there were more wood than you could check a stick at. 
and you'd have no trouble in finding a stick to check it out because there were cartloads of it and I got here last night and, and sink me I could barely find two sticks to rub together and I couldn't even find a boy scout to help me rub them together so, so that's basically what's left so there weren't a great deal of cooking done last night well in fact there weren't any it was just hot water for coffee got to have a cup of joe haven't you although gone 11 at night that might be a strange choice of beverage but anyway so that's about it so in the unlikely event that you've stayed glued to your screen that'll teach you to be more careful what you do with the super glue oh hang, no hang on no that ain't what i meant what i meant was if you kept watching all this time then uh, congratulations because you've more stamina than i have for watching drivel like this so anyway i hope you like the video as always it's a fred carno circus production in association with casey's court promotions of the muse cottage oil drum lane shepherd's bush london oh and i've just seen a swan over there Right there, that little white blob, believe it or not, is a swan. So anyway, so, as always, tell your friends about this channel, but I'm not going to be doing the usual guff that they all do about click, like and subscribe, because obviously nobody likes this drivel. And I'm quite happy with 206 subscribers, so don't click on whatever you do anyway so i hope you like this video thanks for watching and bye